Hello, this is Marty and this is a quick demo on how easy it is to arrange a meeting and a video conferencing call using Gmail and the Chronify Scheduler browser extension for Chrome. So first I'll click on Compose here to create a new email and add in the relevant details. So I am just sending a message to my contact Lucas. I'll add in the subject line and the email message. So that's, hey Lucas, let's catch up to discuss our future plans for the new project. Please pick a time using this link. So I'll need to create a link to let Lucas book a time into my calendar. I haven't got an idea of what Lucas' schedule looks like, but I want to make sure that he's able to meet at a time that's best for him as well. So all I will need to do is just move on over to this top corner here and select the Chronify browser extension. What you'll notice here is that it has conveniently already pre-filled those relevant details. So you've got the email and the contact name as well. If you scroll further down, you'll be able to add an event summary or an event description as well for more context. So we can just add catch up. And also there is something alluding to a video conferencing call. 8x8 is our default video conferencing service however you can connect other services as well if you wish. Just scrolling further down you'll be able to see this calendar. Now this gives an upcoming real-time availability view and these are basically times that Lucas can pick from and this is customizable as well to fit your preferences so the green here highlights the availability and the white shows the unavailability what we'll do now is just click on this button here to create the invitation link and what's really interesting about this is that it's created a unique one-time use only link for Lucas we'll simply just copy that and just paste that into the email and click send. It's that easy. Lucas can now pick a time that will best suit him, knowing that I'm also available at that time and there is no time wasted going back and forth arranging a time. So in case you're wondering what that would look like on the other side for Lucas, it's pretty straightforward. I'll just open up that link that I've just shared with him. And you can see here, be able to select a date. So we can just select Monday. We can also select a time, so say 11 o'clock. That's it. It's all booked in. That will now be reflected in Lucas's calendar as well as mine. If we just have a quick look at my calendar, you'll be able to see here can open that up it's got the relevant information it's got the attendees and you've got the video conference call link as well and there's no setup required you'd simply just click that and load up the meeting and it's really just that simple in creating a video conferencing call or a meeting and you can also try the scheduler for free simply just log on to chronify.com forward slash scheduler